install the Photoshop Creative Cloud. And I'm getting this error code 206, which is saying that Photoshop, for some reasons, cannot communicate with my server. So I'm going to show you how to uh, take care of this. Now, the first thing to do is to, uh, first of all, go to your firewall. And now they, they, they have a recommendation here. They said, check your firewall settings to make sure Adobe's uh, servers are reachable. Try disabling your firewall temporarily when retrying. So what that means is I'm going to put uh, I mean my firewall here. And, and if you don't know how to access this, just uh, hold, press window key and then type in firewall. And that is it right here. Uh, okay. So to what they are saying here, what they are saying, number one here, is that you should go to your firewall and disable it, uh, disable it for uh, temporarily, which I've done already. And uh, once, you're, you, once you've done that, you want to come back to Adobe. And let's see, number two says temporarily disable your antivirus, which is what we've done again. So now we, let me say firewall. Oh, that's not that firewall and this time around we'll be going to uh, windows defender firewall with advanced security i uh, click that to open it and once this is open what you want to do is click on inbound and make sure and and you want to make sure that uh, adobe is not i uh, mean blocked or is not uh, Adobe servers is not being blocked from accessing, uh, your computer is not blocking Adobe from accessing uh, I mean, the internet. So, and then secondly, you want to come to inbound, make sure uh, the same thing is uh, with the inbound rules as well as the outbound rules. This is uh, what they're trying to say right here. And let's go back to here and uh, try again okay this didn't work so another thing you want to do is go into your computer uh, you want to go into your C drive, double click that, and then Windows, then scroll down to System32, down here, open that, then Drivers, uh, Drivers, double click that to open, then ETC, then you want to, what you want to do in here is to right click and copy this host of a file uh, to wherever you wish. Uh, in my case, I've copied it uh, uh, into uh, the my music folder, and then you want to right click and say edit with notepad or whatever editor you have. And you can see this is what I have. So here you want to make sure that Adobe is not disabled. And uh, how that is done is I could have 127.0.0. Uh, zero dot one uh, space uh, and then maybe adobe dot com something like that so you want to make sure uh, it's not and if it is for some reasons what you want to do is add the um, ash there to make sure you are disabling it and save that is if you want it and then what you want to do is go back copy this file copy and then go back to where i mean your etc file in your you can see the directory uh c drive windows system 32 drivers etc 
and paste in there paste and replace come back and refresh your installation wow this time around it has worked so you, you can see it has actually worked it has worked guys see i told you so what you want to do is go in here to continue we want to register using our gmail and um, right so what we want to do is just go here click and register continue okay So you can see that Creative Cloud is installing here and um, that is how you solve the problem. Guys, thank you for watching and see you next time in another video. Bye-bye. Please, 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 please don't forget to subscribe, hit that subscribe button and of course, um, like the video and let the conversation continue under the comments section. Love you guys and bye-bye.